Yo guys, what's going on? This is Software Developer Life, episode five. And this one is making your manager look good. I heard about this piece of advice pretty recently, I think just a month ago when I was perusing through YouTube and it's a real gem. I never thought about this too much, but making your manager look good is a really good, good piece of advice. And first, you can't take it at face value and we're gonna use this video to try to explain it a little better. I know a lot of people out there, your first reaction to this piece of advice might be, oh man, but I don't like working for the man. Uh, my manager is a jerk. I wanna do my own thing. Why do I have to make someone else look good? Don't I wanna make me look good? If that was your first impression, that's totally fine. Let me just try to explain why this piece of advice is really good. First point I wanna make is that if you truly work for a shitty boss, a boss who is unfair, rude, impolite, if you work for a boss like that, remember, I hate to break it to you, but it's actually your own fault. If you have a terrible working circumstance, is that the fault of the company, the fault of this other person, or is that kind of you not putting yourself in a better opportunity? Second point to remember is that everyone answers to someone everyone. There really is no exception to this unless you're just retired on the beach all day. But if you're a new engineer at a big company, you'll probably answer to some middle management. If you're a CEO at a startup, you might answer to your investors. Everyone is answering and accountable to someone else. All right. Don't believe that it ends somewhere. Also remembering that this concept of answering to someone else goes beyond the conventional corporate ladder that we might be used to. Just take Bill Gates, for example, the wealthiest man in the world. He answers to all those charitable organizations that he's involved in. He's accountable to them for being involved in their projects. Answering to someone doesn't mean you just answer to the next person above you. If you've taken on personal responsibility, you're accountable and responsible for other people as well. And that's also answering to them. Okay, so enough of that. Let's just bring it back to engineering and how it's relevant to an engineer's life. As an engineer, you want to make your manager look good. And why is this a good thing? Not only will your manager really like you for making him or her look good, but it'll also cause other people to want you to work for them. Always remember that real recognizes real. And if you're doing a good job, it will be recognized. If you make your manager look good, then other people will want you to work for them because they'll see how good of a job you're doing. Okay, so let's take the example of a CEO at maybe a small startup. A startup CEO, or actually any CEO actually, they wanna make their investors look good as well, right? If you're a CEO or starting your own company, if you make your investors look good, it just naturally leads to other investors wanting to be involved with what you're working on. This is exactly why startup founders that have a good track record just find it easier and easier to raise money more because more investors just want to get a piece of the action. This is really analogous to the good work you do as an engineer. As an engineer, you make your manager look good so other people want you to work for them. As a CEO, you wanna make your investors look good so all these other investors wanna just throw money at you later. It's like the same analogy. This piece of advice isn't about sucking up to whoever is higher than you than the corporate ladder. This is really about just doing a really, really good job and making your manager or whoever you're accountable to look really good. This in turn results in other people wanting you to do that good work for them, which just gives you more leverage. This is something you just do for the rest of your life. It doesn't really stop anywhere. Just keep doing good work and it'll be easy. It'll just be easy. Just do your job well. All right, guys, hope that little piece of advice was helpful for you. If you have any questions or comments, just leave it down below. Please give me a like or thumbs up if you thought this was helpful. And if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. I would really, really appreciate it. And as always, Thank you for watching. All right, I'll catch everyone next week.